Hi Virgo and welcome to your weekly Tauroscope. This is for September 4th through to September 10th. I'm Katie, I'm a professional intuitive tarot card reader. If you're interested in private reading, then you can visit my website, which is katietarot.com. Okay, Virgo, let's see what energy is around you this week. Okay, Monday, Tuesday energy is we have the lovers, which is the coming together of two things, something that you are emotionally involved with, something you have an emotional attachment to. It is a, a beautiful healing card as well. So if you are healing from any kind of illness, sickness or debility, then Monday and Tuesday, um, really positive healing, beautiful vibes are coming your way. Um, this week, some of you will be focusing on bringing together you and a passion or something that you are emotionally connected to or emotionally want in your life. It could literally be a relationship, a person that you want, or you can, you may be continuing on in a relationship. However, it's something that you are emotionally, that you want in your life. You really do want it. And you'll be focused on that this week. Um, so that's a really beautiful healing positive energy that will come in Monday and Tuesday. And it's something that's been around you for a while. It's not a just a this week thing. It's something you've been wanting for a while or planning to pursue for a while. But it's um, it looks like this week is a really good week to implement this thing that you want to do or uh, pursue something that you have been wanting to pursue for some time. Let's have a look midweek for you. <clears throat> and we have the tower. And it looks like it's going to come quite suddenly for you as well. So you might not have been expecting it to happen this fast. Or there might have been a, um, a conflict in the past potentially where you know you think you might have to wait it out sometime before things resolve. But that doesn't look like it's the case. It's actually going to happen quite fast might not happen this week however this is going to be the catalyst this week energetically so they're further on down the line next week and the months to come potentially this area of your life is going to move forward quite fast much faster than what you had previously thought so anyway um, I feel for some of you you need to take a leap of faith and you need to jump into something so um, you may have been planning it for a while and if you have then this is the week to really uh, solidify that and to really just make the leap and go for it and so you're not having to um, uh, carry that with you anymore it's actualizing this week so um, so do it this week you know don't put it off any longer um, so this will happen quite quickly for you much faster than what you had previously thought let's have a look at the weekend energy which is the seven of swords Yeah, you guys are going to feel quite confident in yourself about this. You're really going to clean up basically where you'll be like, wow, I'm so on top of this. I didn't know this was going to happen like this, but I feel so satisfied and happy with it. It's um, it's kind of come out of the blue for me, even though I may have been working towards it. I didn't think it was going to happen this soon. And now it is kind of coming about and this is amazing. That's kind of that, that kind of joy energy, that kind of like, wow, I'm really... Um, I'm really capable of doing this. So that's what's uh, going to happen. So this is Friday, Saturday and Sunday energy for you. So you are capable and you will know that in, um, intuitively and also in your mind. It will be a case of, you know, you are in control and in command now of this area of your life and you're going to be, um, you know, mentally uh, fit and healthy and right to, to follow this down the path to completion or wherever you want to take it you're going to be in the right frame of mind to do it I also feel some for some of you if this is a job thing or related to a job or something like that if you're waiting on a job offer or something like that um, <clears throat> then it's going to be either one of two things so it's going to be either you will get it or you won't but you will get news this week um, let me pull another card for the lovers for Monday, Tuesday energy. We have the eight of cups. 
Yeah, so you're moving away from the past into the future. You may have um, had some hurts in the past or you may have had some, um, some emotional security there um, and you maybe don't want to change things as much as you... Um, as much as they have to be changed but they do have to change and that's kind of what the eight of cups is saying to you this week you'll kind of have this energy of not knowing what it is that you need to change and what you need to do to go about um, about doing it so it will whatever this area is in your life guys remember this is a general reading so you're going to have to place this in your life um, in the area that it is for you so um, it could be romance, it could be love, it could be travel, it could be anything you need to place it. But this Monday, Tuesday energy is one of, you're really, okay, um, I'm kind of turning my back to what um, was done in the past and I know what I want going forward. I'm in tune with my, um, my heart and my passions and what I want in this area of my life and I'm moving forward and I'm going to get it. And it's going to happen faster than what you thought, and which is great and it's um and by the end of the week you're going to be um able mentally to understand this and to kind of go yeah i can comprehend this is actually going to happen and i'm um and i'm moving towards where i want to go with this so let's have a look midweek the second card we've got the nine of cups so yeah, this is going to happen quite fast. Could happen this week for some of you, but I'm feeling for a lot. It's going to be just the start of it this week. Um, and it is going to be emotionally satisfying. So this is something that you have wanted for some time, something that has been potentially on your mind a lot, wanting to change something, wanting to pursue a passion or a goal or something like that. Want to change something up in your life because you might not be fully integrated with what you're doing in your life. Um, within yourself so your heart might not be um, completely in it in this area but this is going to shift now where you are fully in it and you are fully engaged in this area because you're having a bit of a change um, which is what you need and it is on an emotional level so whatever this is there is passion love um, happiness and satisfaction emotionally for you from this change so that's quite beautiful. So the Nine of Cups, you'll be very, very happy and satisfied and you'll have all of your cups full and you'll be um, quite joyous. Might even have a celebration potentially. However, I do feel for most of you, it will be a uh, internal thing where you will become more confident um, and strong emotionally around this issue. Seven of Swords and the Eight of uh, Pentacles underneath. So, so yes, good progress. That's right. So it's not only on a mental level that you are uh, becoming clear of what you want. It's also on the uh, physical level as well. So your heart, um, your heart and your body and your minds are all in this together. You know, this change is something that you want and you need. And so they're all going, they're all um, in alignment and it's in integrity with what you really want which is a really beautiful place to, to be. So this is a really good shift for you. It's something that you have um, wanted for a while. You wanted this change for a while for a lot of you. So it's a, it's a really good thing, really positive thing. And yes, there will be work to be done after this week. It is a longer term thing, but with good planning and keep on um, going the way that you're going, it's going to work out. It's going to be fine. It's go you're going to be doing what you want in the end. Um, and I don't feel it's too far in the future either because I feel this has been more going on in the past leading up to this than it is um, time going forward. I feel that that is more of a, it will come sooner rather than later for you. Um, but all of your faculties as you as a human being are in integrity with this change. Let's look at the advice card for you which is the eight of wands. Uh, yes, so just be warned that this is going to happen sooner than you think, okay? So this thing that you are aiming for, that you want, um, it's going to happen faster than what you think. <laughs> so so uh, be on the lookout for that <laughs> and be aware that that might be the case, okay? So it doesn't take you off guard. 
Okay, so that concludes the reading, guys. If you like the content, then please subscribe to my channel. Until next time, bye for now.